Hi guys, welcome to Ahima's group. In this video, we're going to learn how to find beta. So let's say you have a problem like this one. You own a portfolio that you have invested 27.54% on a stock A, 13.01% in a stock B, 18.13% on a stock C, and the remainder in a stock D. If you have the beta of these four stocks, which they are 0 0.27, 0 0.89, 0 0.66, and 0.8, what is the portfolio beta? First of all, what is beta? Well, beta basically is a very important measurement of the systematic risk. This is the risk that you cannot diversify. So when you have a security, uh, a security or a portfolio, you need to figure it out what is your beta because that's going to tell you how, how much risk you have against the market. So how do we do this problem? Well, very easy. The formula is the following. You're going to grab every single weight of your stock, so 0.2754, if, remember, I'm putting it in decimals, 0.1301, 18.13, and then you're going to multiply each one by each beta. Now, before we start, I don't have a stock D, so I need to figure it out how much I invested on a stock D. So look what I'm going to do. You always should have 100% on your investment because you need to do 27 on one, 13 on the other one, 18 on B, and I'm sorry, 18 on C. So how much did you invest on D? Well, First, you do one minus, and then you just do every single percentages, so that way you can have the remainder, which is, in this case, stock D is going to be 0.4132. Now that we have this information, we can go ahead and figure out what is beta. So look at this. I just do the weight times the stock, I'm sorry, times the beta. So look, the weight of the stock times beta, and then here the weight of the stock times the beta, and then you add all of that, and you finally get the portfolio beta, which in this case is 0.64. Finally, what does this mean? Well, when beta is equals to 1, that means the security price is moving with the market. But if you have a value less than 1, which in this case, 0.64, you have a less, you are actually less volatile than the market. Your portfolio beta is less volatile than the market. And that is good. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Please don't forget, we can always Skype with you. And also, thanks so much for learning.